I'm solving part A of problem 455 uh, color B is moving vertically along the road and this spring is on stretch when it's at the horizontal position in other words the spring is on stretch when theta is equal to 0 we're going to find the equation between theta W and K uh, actually t the theta where the color is at the stationary position and doesn't move vertically so actually this problem is related to the equilibrium subject first of all I assume that on stretch length of the spring is L and the stretched length is L prime and obviously elongation is the final length minus initial length is L prime minus L and I called it delta on the other hand we have a triangle here A C and B if you look at A C B we can uh, write this equation L is equal to L prime cosine theta or L, L prime is L over cosine theta from the this triangle then delta is L prime minus L or it's L over cosine theta minus L I can rewrite it as L over cosine theta times 1 minus cosine theta then uh, actually this is mm, only the geometry of the problem now I'm going to uh, draw the free body diagram of the color and uh, write the equilibrium equations for that so here we have a color the weight W is downward N is the force applied from the surface of the rod to the color and I show it by N it's perpendicular to the direction of the color the, the, the direction it moves is vertical so it, N is horizontal and we have a for we have the force of spring I call it T it's applied at the direction of theta obviously T equals the spring constant times the elongation of the spring which is K times L over cosine theta times 1 minus cosine theta so I keep it as this and then I write the equilibrium along Y direction which is sigma FY 0 T sine theta is the first vertical force we have here and the other one is W so T sine theta minus W because W is down, downward is equal to 0 so I substitute T here KL cosine theta times 1 minus cosine theta and then times sine theta is equal to W I can simply uh, rewrite this equation as tan theta minus sine theta is equal to W over KL that's the equation we need to find theta actually solving this problem this equation is a little complicated and we have to solve it numerically that's why I didn't do part B mm, you have to use a software like MATLAB or apply some numerical methods to solve this equation